diseases of cow pig now we'll see the list of important diseases in uh, cow pig so scientific name of cow pig is vigna anguculata no, my name is nh shankar reddy and i am doing phd plant pathology in anamalai university coming to the list of important diseases uh, these are the list of important diseases in uh, cow pig root rot or damping off which is caused by the species of uh, pythium uh, rhizoctonia and as well as macrophomena and southern blight is caused by Schleroschen Rolfsi, Fusarium will discuss by Fusarium Oxysporum and uh, Cowpea Mosaic is caused by Cowpea Mosaic Virus. Now we will see in detail about one by one. So first one is Root Rot or Damping Up which is caused by Pythium Rhizoctonia or Macrophomena species. So on the right side we can clearly see the uh, symptom. Uh, you know uh, the name itself indicates rotting of roots. Uh, we can see the uh, root and as well as uh, 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 stem region here, I mean uh, uh, stem region nearby uh, uh, root here and a rapid death of uh, young plants can be seen along with uh, uh, we can know discoloration of uh, tap roots can be seen and uh, if we cut open uh, uh, this root we can clearly see the uh, you know, black color discoloration of the vascular bundles and uh, due to the resulting of uh, root rot or damping of uh, height of the plant can be reduced that is called stunting and as well as wilting and poor yield also can be observed so coming to the management aspect soil application of pseudomonas fluorescence or trichoderma will at the rate of 2.5 kg per hectare plus 50 kg of well decomposed farmyard manure or sand application can give a little bit relief on uh, uh, from this root rot disease and the soil drenching carbon at the rate of 1 gram per liter can be recommended so coming to the second disease that is southern blight which is caused by Schleroschium ralsi if it is a Schleroschium ralsi we can see white color uh, cottony mycelial growth can be seen on the stem region as well as in the root region we can clearly see white color mycelial growth these are most visible symptoms and along with the black mustard shaped Schleroschia are produced on the stem so the stem is covered with white color uh, cottony mycelial growth as well as mustard shaped Schleroschia are produced on the stem itself we can see clearly see here white color mycelial growth along with the mustard Schleroschia so this Schleroschia are normally uh, round in color or sometimes dark brown in color or uh, uh, you know uh, 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 come uh, later stages they completely converted into black in color so if you see the leaves uh, yellowing and wilting of foliages can be observed on uh, leaf regions in stem regions white color mycelial growth is very common along with the formation of uh, brown color or black color schleroschial bodies so coming to the cowpea mosaic virus third one which is a caused uh, cowpea mosaic which is caused by cowpea mosaic virus so coming to and the, and we can, if you see the leaves we can clearly observe yellowing of leaves is the very common in all viral diseases as we discussed earlier and we can also see the rapid death of young succulents leaf in young, if you see young succulents leaf or oh, rapid death can be observed uh, i mean observed along with the yellowing is a very common symptom so we can see here alternate green and yellow patches but mostly we can observe yellow color uh, uh, symptoms here in here and uh, discoloration can also be observed on tap roots as well as uh, uh, if the you know uh, uh, cowpea mosaic virus infected plants also show uh, stunting and wilting of roots and as well as you know, uh, uh, you know poor yields also can be observed here so coming to management aspects roguing out of cowpea mosaic virus infected plant in the earlier stage of growth uh, up to 30 days and uh, you know uh, 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 and uh, 30 days before and uh, uh, and uh, spraying uh, twice fortnight intervals of monocrotopus because the viral disease is transmitted by wire, I mean, nectar. So, spraying of monocrotopus at the rate of 500 ml per hectare or methyl dematon uh, 25% EC at the rate of 500 ml per hectare can be recommended. So, last one is Fusarium wilt, which is caused by Fusarium oxysporum, which is a fungal pathogen. Coming to the symptoms, we can clearly see here vascular discolorations or brown color vascular discolorations or color change. If we cut open, uh, if we uh, longitudinal, if we see the system regions, if we cut open and we can see vascular discolorations or you know, a brick red tissues or uh, appearance of brick red tissues can be observed when we split uh, uh, roots, root regions. Clearly, we can see. It. So, name itself indicates that is fusarium wilt. A wilting of plants also can be very clearly observed and you know. Uh, due to wilting is mainly due to you know uh, you know uh, uh, formation of gas bubbles can't not completely say gas bubbles are due to this uh, water conducting tissue completely lost its capability to tra you know translocate or transmit water from roots to shoots so that they start slowly starts to wilting symptoms and brown color discoloration as well as brick red color discoloration of uh, roots if we cut open we can see and uh, some of the cases we can also see here uh, 
uh, you know a light uh, uh, alternate green in color initial stage it was it looked like alternate green color later it turns to uh, you know brown color or brick red in color this is a uh, uh, fusarium wilt and uh, uh, you know uh, if you see in the leaf regions we can also observe the yellowing of symptoms as well as especially lower leaves yellowing of uh, uh, leaves can also be observed in fusarium wilt coming to the management aspects uh, you know uh, using of high quality seeds or labeled seeds of cowpea and uh, crop rotation along with uh, uh, cultural practices or required additional cultural practices along with you know planting a resistant varieties and controlling of weeds and, and the removal of virus infected plants in the field uh, uh, can give a relief uh, i mean a relief from this uh, uh, diseases so coming to questions related to ars arnet and casal organisms will be uh, as we uh, discussed earlier in each and every uh, you know uh, crop uh, casal organisms will be have a great chance of asking uh, from any side and any crop and when coming to the cowpea we can see cowpea mosaic virus uh, seems to be a little bit important and i had seen uh, uh, in earlier question papers not in net and ars but in uh, uh, you know uh, you know particular exams or you know uh, students who are writing their uh, board exams or something so copy mosaic virus will be one of the important one along with the castle organisms and maybe fusarium will sometimes they may ask uh, uh, this is about copy